Uh, number three, Paul from Prestonburg, Kentucky. Greetings from the Bluegrass State, Dennis. Greetings. I have heard you tell the story on your radio show several times. <laughs> All right, I get the hint. About your ideological shift from left to right. I don't know. I've always been on the right on certain things. Honest to God, I have. I know myself. Um, not all of them, and indeed I have, I don't know, I, I view people who don't kind of favor that way as they get older to not be paying attention. It's like they say, young men should be righteous and liberal, and older men, you get a little more pragmatic and conservative. So, 9-11 um, did codify some things for me. Before that, uh, Admiral Stockdale made me feel a little sheepish about being liberal when they mocked him. But I've always been a pragmatist from uh, my youth on certain things. But I do not believe I have heard you say when you first went public leadership. Yeah, Ad Admiral Stockdale, when they made fun of him. Uh, Ross Perot's vice presidential candidate when he said, I don't even know what I'm doing here. And, uh, you know, they mocked him because he was bad on TV. Meanwhile, this is a man who used to talk kids out of dying in the Hanoi Hilton through a code, of code system that he would tap out on the pipes to keep their spirits up. And, uh, you know, a man who would face more than we ever faced. And I just remember when they mocked him, I thought, oh, fuck this business, this politics, liberal politics. I don't mind you slashing and burn, uh, you know, that, that's the nature of it. Pundits can slash and burn other pundits, fine. But when you take a guy like Admiral Stockdale and start calling him an asshole, you, you, I, you, that room's gotten too cool for me. So that's when I first said it. I'm curious, was it a gradual rollout or something more spectacular? Well, like I said, a lot of it was always there in pragmatism. My job description predicated I tear right and left a new one, so I did. Uh, Admiral Stockdale I found embarrassing. 9-11 cemented in my head as far as radical Islam. They had to kill them before they killed us. I'm still liberal on a lot of things, but nobody chooses to notice because the left, like I said, is so much in lockstep it makes the uh, June Taylor dancers look like moment shots. I don't even know what that one meant. I think I did. <laughs> Crying. Crying. Enjoy these samples of the bathrobe sessions, a weekly video available only to members of the DMZ, the Dennis Miller Zone on DennisMillerRadio.com.